On a cold February day in Queens, New York, skeletal remains of a teenage girl were discovered. On February 4, 1994, police were called to an abandoned lot behind a power plant near the Long Island Railroad tracks and Gwen Eiffel Park in the St. Albans section of Queens. The medical examiner concluded that the remains had been there since sometime between 1993 and 1994. They belonged to a black African-American girl aged 16 to 19, who stood about 5 feet 5 inches tall. Due to the skeletal nature of the remains, her weight could not be determined. She had long, wavy brown hair and a distinctive keloid scar on the front of her right knee, a thick raised scar most likely caused by a dysfunction of the wound healing process. The cause of death remains undisclosed, and it appears that not all of the girl's remains were recovered. When found, she was dressed in a brown leather jacket, blue jeans, a purple sweater, and a scarf with brown, black, and white patterns. She wore blue, green, and purple Nike Air Jordan sneakers. In the jacket pocket, investigators found an eyeliner pencil, a cherry-flavored chapstick with the brand Chapette, a makeup compact with a mirror which appears to be foundation or powder, and a pair of glasses. Despite the gravity of the discovery, there has been little media coverage or local effort to identify the remains. Unfortunately, this seems to be the case with many cases like this one. The National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, however, has created sketches, and a cast of her likeness was concluded in an attempt to aid in this young woman's identification. Anyone with information that could help identify this young girl or provide details about her death is urged to contact the Office of the Chief Medical Examiner for New York City.